Hello, and welcome to another episode in our series on getting started with the client libraries for the Google Ads API. I'm Matteo Tommasone, and in this episode, we are going to see how to obtain one of the credentials that you will need to use the API, the developer token. If you already have a developer token, then feel free to skip to the next video. We have a video in our authentication series that covers in detail how to obtain a developer token, but we will go over the process together once again. First of all, a developer token is tied to a manager account, so you will need one to obtain a developer token. If you don't have a manager account, there is a link to the instructions to create one in the video description below. Once you are signed in to your manager account, you can obtain a developer token by navigating to Tools and Settings and then selecting API Center under the Setup submenu. Note that the API Center menu item will not appear if the account you're signed into is not a manager account. Now, what we have to do is to fill the API access form and accept the terms and conditions. I'm going to insert my email, the name of my company, and its URL. It's important that these are actual values so that your website URL is functioning and that the email you provide leads to a regularly monitored inbox because we may look at the website or reach out for clarifications to confirm that the request for a developer token is legitimate. Then I'm going to select the company type that best fits my company and then a description of the use I intend to make of my developer token. Here I'm going to input campaign creation. You can click on the learn more link to see more details about the different types of permissible use of the Google Ads API. Then I have to confirm my principal place of business and to accept the terms and conditions. And once I've done that, the last thing left to do is to click on create token and my developer token is ready. Note that it now shows up in your API center with a test account access level. There are three different access levels a developer token can have, test account access, basic access, and standard access. Developer tokens with test account access can only access test accounts. So to access a non-test customer account, you will need to apply for basic access. To do so, click on the link in your access level detail and fill up the form. Be aware that it may take a couple of days to get approved. Once you're approved for basic access, the link will be updated to apply for standard access. The main difference between basic and standard access is in the number of daily calls of the API that your developer token can make. I'll leave you a link to the details of the differences between access levels in the video description below. Now, the only thing left to do is to note the value of your developer token, as you will need it when making your first Google Ads API call, and then proceed to the next step in our video series. I'll see you there.